All right, guys, I'm going to show you guys how to make a homemade digital counter out of a calculator. It's pretty easy. All you need is a calculator. I picked this one up at a dollar store for a dollar. And then I got this reed switch from Home Depot. Or I mean, from a, a local electric shop, Home Depot. Didn't have it, but regardless. So first thing you want is a circuit board like that. If yours has a perf paper circuit board, then you can't use it, obviously. So I don't know if you guys can see those little holes on the circuit board there. But what you want to do is on the equal button, on the other side where the circuit board is, there should be two holes right there where I have already soldered the leads to the magnetic lead wire and what you want to do is <clears throat> these little holes have like an enamel coating so you have to scrape it off with a blade or something as you can see I did it to this one so you guys can see what it looks like that one right there I don't know if my camera is quality shitty but then here's one without the enamel coating off it so it's still on there so you scrape that off then you tin your leads and you tin that little hole and you solder the two leads. It doesn't matter which leads go where, you just put them on the hole. And just as long as they're on the other side of the circuit board, exactly where that equals button is, then you put everything together, make it look all nifty. And then what you do is you push one plus and then every time the magnet lead hits the other one it'll create a counter for you guys and you guys can use this for a, a little uh, homemade pickup winder to count your wines hopefully that'll help you guys